Good morning, everybody, and this is your Dow Jones day trade setup for today. So, first things first, we can just start off in the monthly, and you can see we have a, some sort of a range bar that is busy forming. The thing that is worrying me is look at the oscillators, look how far we are from the moving averages. So, you know, we desperately need a half decent pullback, to be honest with you. And, um, you know, the pullback problem is the structure is a good 14% away so that would be a 14% move to the downside which would basically come back to where we opened for the year now whether that's going to happen or not is another story so you know, what we need to do is we need to focus on the structure that we see on the lower time frames because that's where we make our money now this area here and I'm going to put two levels in because that is the reality so um, that is the floor at the moment so if we get below this i'd expect some kind of a move to the downside to find support lower down but three four five fourteen three four uh four seventy three so just round that off at uh, thirty four five hundred area for the dow is the area of interest and that would be the floor as far as i'm concerned right now um, if we start moving down through the time frames if you look at the three hour We've got a crossover here, so we should see some sort of continuation back onto support. And the reason why I say that is the floor. You can see we do have the seven shoulders here as well. We haven't quite tested it. There's my shoulder. There's my head. There's my shoulder. And then also flat top triangle. So you can see if you draw a trend line along there. Let me just do it like that. And that's the top. You can see that's a flat top triangle. So that would be an area to be buying off somewhere in between those two levels at the moment if you look at Friday's price action I mean tails the upside tails the downside barbed wire complete confusion you know we opened up there we closed down here so that's a pretty solid red bar uh, not quite going into halfway of, of uh, the Thursday bar but definitely not looking very pretty so the question here is are we getting profit taking uh, we're definitely not getting selling that's for sure so it just looks like people there was nobody selling on friday going into the weekend still holding it and hoping for the best so for me i'm very weary right now i have been sideways for quite some time uh, even though you think it's uh been some move but look at how choppy it's been uh, every drop has been sold at the top and then you know bottoms have been bought and we are making ever so slightly we are making new highs you can see there that are there but my big question at the moment is is this sort of consolidating into some kind of a flag and with all the moving averages sorry all the oscillators grouping like they are i'm a little bit cautious so anyway plan of action for today right now is uh, to see if we can get back onto 34 500 area see if we can find some uh, support there and look for an opportunity to buy a smallish position there's your stop your stop is kind of below that swing low there that's your stop area uh, but i'm not entirely confident on that and it is uh, friday so sorry not friday it's monday listen to me and uh, mondays are normally pretty muted and quiet so this could just drift sideways as well the next thing just to bear in mind is that we do have this triangle here now if you come down to the 50 minutes you'll see that a bit clearer see there's our consolidation triangle so if we do break it to the downside i wouldn't want to be selling because you've got too much structure here so i'd want to see what's going to happen lower down before looking for an opportunity and uh, the last thing to just point out yeah look at the oscillators in the middle okay pretty much slap bang in the middle value of 56 and 51 so consolidation triangle oscillators in the middle whenever that happens you're anticipating a break of some sort uh, very difficult to ascertain which way because uh, we are technically sideways so i don't really see anything at the moment uh, if i do see something i'll let you know on the telegram channel but for now this is sit quietly and wait for structure and uh, i have a feeling we're going to have another week of what we saw on Friday uh, while we go into the jobs number 
So we've got non-farm payrolls. We've got uh, job number Thursday, the non-farm payrolls on Friday. So I think that's kind of what we're going to be waiting for. And um, there is chatter about more stimulus as well, believe it or not. So uh, we're going to have to wait and see, and see what happens. And then we'll be able to capitalize on whatever is hitting the markets. But for me at the moment, this is keep the money in the pocket. It's a fantastic trade, guaranteed to be profitable. Anyway, hope it helps and uh, we'll catch you later. Cheers for now.